Welcome to the History of Simple Things, where we delve into the fascinating history behind the little things that shape our world. Hello everyone, and welcome back to our channel. Today we're diving deep into a fascinating topic that often goes unnoticed but plays a crucial role in our daily lives. High voltage ceramic insulators, specifically why they have those distinctive disc shapes. By the end of this video, you'll have a thorough understanding of the purpose and benefits of these discs in high voltage ceramic insulators. Let's get started. First, let's start with the basics. What exactly is a ceramic insulator? Ceramic insulators are critical components in electrical systems used to prevent the unwanted flow of current to the ground from an electrical conductor. They are crafted from high-strength porcelain, a type of ceramic known for its durability and excellent insulating properties. These insulators have been a part of our electrical infrastructure since the 1950s, replacing the older glass insulators due to their superior performance and longevity. In high voltage applications, such as power transmission lines, insulators must withstand not only electrical stress, but also environmental factors like weather changes, pollution, and physical wear and tear. This is where the design and material of the insulator become crucial. High voltage ceramic insulators are preferred because they offer high dielectric strength, which means they can resist electrical breakdown even under intense electrical fields. Now let's focus on the primary subject of our video, the discs on high voltage ceramic insulators. These discs, often seen stacked in a string formation, are not just a random design choice. They serve several important functions that enhance the performance and reliability of the insulators. The primary reason for the disc design is to improve electrical insulation. Each disc acts as a barrier to electric current, preventing leakage, in high voltage transmission, the potential difference between the conductor and the ground can be extremely high. A single solid insulator would not be practical due to the risk of electrical breakdown. By using a series of discs, the potential difference is divided among them, reducing the voltage stress on each individual unit. This configuration significantly lowers the risk of flashover, where electricity arcs across the surface of the insulator. Mechanical strength is another critical factor. Transmission lines can be subjected to various mechanical stresses, including tension from the wires, wind pressure, and even ice loading in colder climates. The disc-shaped insulators distribute these mechanical stresses evenly along the length of the insulator string. This distribution helps to prevent mechanical failure, ensuring the insulators can support the weight and tension of the wires they are holding. Environmental factors such as pollution and weather can affect the performance of insulators. Dust, salt, and industrial pollutants can settle on the surface of insulators, creating a conductive path for leakage currents. The disc design minimizes this risk in two ways. First, the shape and orientation of the discs create a larger surface area, making it harder for contaminants to form a continuous conductive path. Second, Rain and wind can more effectively clean the insulator surface, maintaining its insulating properties. There are several types of high-voltage ceramic insulators, each designed for specific applications and stress conditions. Let's go through some of the common types. Pin-type insulators are mounted on a pin on the cross arm of poles. These are used for relatively lower voltage lines and consist of a single ceramic unit. Their design includes a head and a body, with the head supporting the conductor. Suspension type insulators are the ones most commonly associated with the disc design. They are used for higher voltage applications and are suspended from towers, with the conductor hanging below. The string of discs allows for the handling of higher voltages and greater mechanical stresses. Lastly, Strain insulators are used in situations where the wire has to withstand tensile stress, such as at the end of a line or at sharp turns. They are also disc-shaped and are used to handle the mechanical load from the conductor tension. 
Let's now talk about the advantages of using ceramic insulators. Ceramic insulators offer several advantages over other types of insulators, such as those made from polymer or glass. Their hardness and wear resistance ensure longevity and consistent performance. Ceramic materials are also highly resistant to corrosion, making them ideal for use in harsh outdoor environments. Moreover, ceramics have excellent thermal conductivity, which helps in dissipating the heat generated by electrical currents. The manufacturing process of ceramic insulators involves several stages, ensuring they meet the high standards required for high voltage applications. The raw materials, typically a mixture of clay, quartz, and feldspar, are first shaped into the desired form. This is followed by a glazing process to enhance the surface properties, and then firing at high temperatures to achieve the necessary mechanical strength and electrical properties. Ceramic insulators are used across a wide range of applications, from power distribution to industrial machinery and even household appliances. Maintaining these insulators involves regular inspections and cleaning to ensure their surfaces remain free of contaminants that could affect their insulating properties. Advanced techniques, such as ultrasonic cleaning and high-pressure washing, are often used in power transmission lines to maintain the efficiency and reliability of the insulators. As we conclude our journey, the disc design of high-voltage ceramic insulators is a result of careful engineering to enhance their electrical insulation, mechanical strength, and ability to withstand environmental conditions. These insulators are vital for the safe and efficient operation of high-voltage power transmission systems, ensuring that electricity can be delivered over long distances without loss or hazards. The use of ceramics in these insulators offers additional benefits in terms of durability, resistance to corrosion, and thermal stability. We hope this video has provided you with a comprehensive understanding of why high-voltage ceramic insulators have discs and the critical role they play in our electrical infrastructure. If you found this video informative, please give it a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more in-depth explorations of fascinating topics. Thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.